Well, the, the Grove, I think, is a, is a tremendous uh, golf experience. I mean, from the time you arrive and the, the whole atmosphere of coming across the bridge, and you arrive into the Grand Estate, and to, to have an a, 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 a estate like this is accessible uh, every day of the year to either hotel guests or, or uh, outside play, really, I think, is, is a remarkable uh, kind of opportunity here in the London area, uh, you'll find a quality of maintenance and service and uh, design that uh, I think rivals any experience you'll, you'll have anywhere. When I think of the Grove, you know, it always puts a smile on my face because we had so much fun. I did personally designing the golf course and the, the, the team spirit here, the owners were very much involved in this and the commitment that they wanted from the design team uh, really aligned with what you know, I like is, is, is to work with a, a team of people and to work closely with the owners and to have a clear vision and have a clear uh, idea about where we're trying to, to land uh, in the marketplace, commercially, but also architecturally. And the way here we were able to mix the old with the new and really develop, um, I think something that was Fresh, not only I think in terms of as you walk through the, the spa, you walk through the little garden, the, the hotel itself, but also on the golf course. If you look across, it feels very traditional, but you get inside and it really handles the modern game well. And uh, you know, it's capable obviously of being set up for many types of, of venues for many types of players. So, you know, there's it's always nice to come back here and see that the ideas that were put forward in the early days have been realized. And, the consistency of management and in, in the maintenance of you know, Phil's effort here has uh, really paid dividends and maintained consistency of quality now for you know, over a decade.